Guess who was a good boy and didn't spend that much money this month? Not me! Konnichiwa minasan, genki desu ka? I'm Dave and today I'm going to share my October haul. Ugh, I spent so much money last month. You know what, I don't even keep track anymore. That is not a good thing. But before we get to my October haul, there is something from my September haul that I forgot to share and I am wearing it right now. This is the third Monster Hunter sweater from Capcom that I have bought and it is by far my favorite one. Why you ask? Well, oh my god, look at the ears! <laughs> this thing is so cute. Look at the attention to detail and I love the pink. And even the side of the hood has these designs. The shape of the hood is really nice. And this is such a beautifully designed sweater. So I'm not a big fan of Monster Hunter, believe it or not. I do like those games. But when it comes to Monster Hunter sweaters, these are by far the best. Now I would wear this for the whole review, but it's actually getting pretty hot. So, oh, what is this I'm wearing underneath? Oh. That's right, I am wearing my magical boy girl shirt and it is long sleeve which is awesome. And this shirt comes courtesy from that anime store. You guys have heard me mention this store before. This is Jess's store from Go Figure and this is an awesome shirt, awesomely designed. So again, awesome job Jess with this shirt. I really love it. I am so freaking adorable, right? So don't forget to check out that anime store. All those links are down below in the description. Also if you guys notice my channel icon changed it's no longer best girl Nico. It's actually now a picture of me in Nendroid form and he is so cute. And that is all thanks to Lauren who drew this for me for my one year anniversary and birthday. So thank you Lauren. I'm going to leave a link to her Instagram down below so make sure to follow her because she is a really talented artist and she draws really cute pictures like the one that is now my profile picture. So thanks again Lauren. I really appreciate it. I love the picture so much. So let's go ahead and move on to my October haul. So before we get to my AmiAmi Ami shipment, I picked up some stuff outside of AmiAmi Ami, as I tend to do. I actually bought stuff from Pokemon Center. Starting off with this Sharpedo hat. I think this is Sharpedo, right? Sharpedo is one of my favorite water Pokemon because I am a San Jose Sharks fan, as you guys may know. Uh, I love the Sharks. I love water Pokemon. They are my favorite type. I also like dark Pokemon, and this is a great hat because of this design right here on the bill of the cap. This is so beautiful and so cool. And it's funny because I'm not really a hat person, but this past year I have bought so many hats. I tend to wear them when I go out now, so. I also picked up these two Pikachu who are so freaking cute. As you guys know, I love Pikachu. Pikachu is by far my favorite Pokemon. What I love about this too is that the material of the raincoats are really nice, but the material of the umbrella is kind of crappy, so I guess you got to take one with the other. Um, what's great about this is there is also this little illustration right here, and it is freaking just as cute as the plushes themselves. It even has like a sort of poem thingy. Rain is falling, drip, drop, drip. Two Pikachu are happily sharing an umbrella. Even if rainy days don't go away, these two still have fun. And if you thought that was all the Pikachu stuff I got, well you'd be wrong because more Pikachu! Like I said, I love Pikachu, but this isn't no ordinary Pikachu. This Pikachu talks and his ears move. So this Pikachu actually says 10 different things, but I don't know how to get him to say 10 different things. So you kind of have to like maneuver him in a way, like squeeze him like in a certain angle or how many times, I have to look it up. But this is so cute. This was actually from Amazon and I think it was like 25 bucks. So talking Pikachu for 25 bucks with moving ears. Yes, please. <laughs> Alright, so time to move on to my Ami Ami haul, starting with, of course, Ami Ami always has one of these postcards. And this is by far my favorite postcard that they've had. This is actually a new one, and I think this is my favorite because there is like this little tiny Umaru-chan thingy 
down here by Amiko's Legs. Now, like I said earlier, I'm starting to collect more and more hats, and I don't really know why I bought this hat, but that's right, I bought an aqua hat, and it's very cute and very plain. It just says aqua, no design, which is why I'm confused as to why I bought it. This hat was like $30 too, but I don't know, gotta show my aqua support, right? Meh. And speaking of Aqua and Love Live, I picked up these three jigsaw puzzles. These are like tiny puzzle pieces. I got Yo-chan, Chika, and Hanamaru-chan. These pieces are a lot smaller than I thought they would be. I kind of can't wait to put them together. I'm probably not going to do a video on it, but I might do a time lapse and post it on Instagram. So if you guys are not following me, make sure to follow me because I like to post time lapses on there. And if you look through my feed, you'll see time lapses of like reviews that I've done and stuff like that. A lot of behind the scenes stuff. There are puzzles for all nine girls. These are 126 puzzle pieces. I'm so bad at putting puzzles together. I kind of wish I bought all nine, but I'm glad I just kept myself to three of my favorites. Moving on, I picked up crazy diamond this is minissimo number three if you guys remember last month i picked up minissimo number one and that is josuke higashikata and this is josuke's stan crazy diamond the only reason i picked this up is because i picked up josuke and i'm gonna do a review for josuke's minissimo very soon so look for that within the next couple of weeks i'm probably gonna do a separate review on this guy but from what i can see he doesn't really come with a lot and the thing with the minissimo is that they are very expensive despite not having a whole lot of accessories but I had to buy them because I bought Josuke and there are other Minisimos from Jojo's Bizarre Adventure that I want but I cannot justify spending a hundred dollars because if I have to buy one character I have to buy his stand too. I'm looking at you Kira. Now we are at the Nendroid portion of this haul. I got a couple of Nendroids starting with the Nendroid more face case parts case thingy and this time it's a rabbit. As you guys remember I have the bear, the pink bear and the tabby cat, the orange tabby cat and now I have the rabbit to go along with them. I can't wait to decide which faceplate I put in here. Up next I picked up Zelda the Wind Waker version. As you guys remember I did a review for Wind Waker Link and he is right there and now I have Zelda to go along with him. Of course I'm going to do a review and it's nice to have the cute couple together again and it really makes me want to play Wind Waker because I've never played a Zelda game before so it would be nice if Wind Waker was my first. Not to be outdone, this Nendroid is probably one of my most anticipated Nendroids of the second half of 2016 and is probably one of the best Nendroids to come out. One of my personal favorites from an anime that I love dearly and that is Luluko from Space Patrol Luluko. If you have not seen this anime, check it out. It is from Studio Trigger, the same studio that did Kill a Kill and each episode is only a couple minutes long. Such a funny crazy anime and Luluko is such a funny cute character and her Nendroid went all out. Love this Nendroid and she has some of my favorite face plates just ever. I think she is so cute and I just love her accessories. I kind of wish I bought more Luluko Nendroids. Now the last Nendroid I got this month was a bit of a surprise when I got him. I did not expect him to come in the condition that he did and that Nendroid is Ryoma Ichizen from the Prince of Tennis and I think this is specifically from the new Prince of Tennis which is the more recent anime but that is actually still a couple years old. From the box the hand pieces look like they've gotten out of their socket which is unfortunate. What's surprising is that this is a small box like the Love Live boxes and that is so weird because Ryoma has a bunch of accessories. He has a lot more accessories than the Love Live Nendroids. He has three face plates unlike the Love Live Nendroids that have two and I picked up Atobe which is another character from Prince of Tennis and I guess he's going to be in a small box too. Either way I love this Nendroid. Uh, I'm a big fan of Prince of Tennis if you guys have not seen it. It's like Kuroko no Basuke but with tennis 
Like, these guys have superpowers <laughs> with the way they hit the ball. It's crazy. All right, so we are at the last thing I picked up for the month of October, and this is something that I have wanted for a long time. It actually has been sitting in my Ami Ami wish list for months, but I got an order delayed to November shipment, and that kind of freed up some space for me to spend more money. And so I saved the best for last, and it is not Menma related or Anohana related, believe it or not. What I picked up is... Ah! <laughs> if you guys don't know what this is, this is from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. And this is probably the most important relic from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. If you guys have not seen JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, I won't spoil it, but this is such an important figure. I mean, this is the thing that starts off the Bizarre Adventure. This is the thing. This mask. This is actually a puzzle, a 3D puzzle and you have to put it together and it says here that there are 57 pieces so I cannot wait to start putting this thing together. I don't know if I'm gonna do a video on it but from the pictures that I've seen the quality of the mask looks really nice like just the way it's designed like just <laughs> just looking at this mask uh, it's really nice that I finally have it and I can't wait to put it together so oh Jojo the Bizarre Adventure is so good. Alright so that is my October haul thank you guys for watching Make sure to tell me all the awesome stuff that you guys picked up last month. I definitely want to know maybe you picked up something that I might want to get. I hope not. I don't want to spend more money than I need to, especially when I've got Pikachus to buy. So that's going to do it for me here today. Thank you guys again for watching. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Jane. Hey Pikachu, now that the video's over, what do you want to go do? Pika! Oh damn, Pikachu, that's nasty! Well, when you put it that way... Wait a second, what do you do with the bodies when you're done with them? Pika! Oh, god damn, Pikachu! What the hell is wrong with you? Pika! Oh, god. Pika! Oh, I think I'm gonna be sick! Pika!